As the green flag flies, we're underway. Heat race number one for the Matt's Warehouse Mud Lights. And it will be John Priest, the man out front, showing the way as they work their way through turns three and four. John Priest with a healthy lead off of turn number four. He'll show him at the line. That's going to be the 95 of Colin Bender, followed by Hayden Bender and Brandy Myers. The Bender Racing entries running second, third, and fourth as the 97 machine of Hayden Bender looks underneath the 95 of Colin Bender. Can't quite do anything with him. So work their way down the back stretch into turn number three. See the 97 Hayden Bender going to start his assault once again as 95 of Colin gets a little squirrely off of turn number four. They go side by side. Give that position to the 97 machine of Hayden Bender. Here comes Brandy Myers to the outside now with the 95 of Colin Bender. They go side by side off of turn number two. Going to be a drag race down the back straightaway. Brandy Myers takes over that third spot on the outside of the 95 machine of Colin Bender. So move a Colin Bender back to the fourth spot. Rounding out your top five in fifth is Scott Elderworth with Jeff Lowe rounding out the field. Out front, no change. Here's we have two laps remaining. John Priest. He is all by his lonesome out front, leading the field off a of turn at number two. <laughs> Followed by the 97 of Hayden Bender, Randy Myers, and Colin Bender. Still duking out for that third spot. Boyfriend, girlfriend there on the racetrack, racing hard for that third position as white flag flies for John Priest. <laughs> He'll lead the field off a of turn number two one final time. No pressure behind him. Almost a full straightaway advantage here in this sixth lap. First heat race of the night. And it will be John Priest winning heat race number one over the 97 of Hayden Bender. 94 of Brandy Myers and Colin Bender in the 95. It's going to be a drag race. Give it to Brandy Myers over Colin Bender and Scott Elderworth. This green flag will fly once again here. But for calling the first start back. But it will be Brennan Priest jumping out to the early advantage as they go three wide for that second spot. One car around, though. Gary DeWitt in the 77. He'll spin her off a of turn number two. Grit the car refire, though. We stay green on the racetrack. So we stay green on track as the leaders come off a of turn number four. Will be Brendan Priest followed by Sean Connors in the second spot with Michael Prey, Tony Martin, and a big gaggle of cars going into turn at number one. And it's Brendan Priest right now pulling away from the 114 of Connors and the rest of the field. As the 88 of Michael Prey and Tony Martin, they do battle right now for that third spot. Martin to the outside of Prey as they work off a turn at number four. Give the third position to Martin. So Michael Prey falls back to the fourth position. In fifth is the 24 of Richard Kemp and the 70 of Raymond Doyle. Gary DeWitt rounding out your field after spinning out on lap number two. So Brennan Priest, like father, like son, here this Father's Day weekend. Right now, showing the way off a of turn at number four. He has himself about a 10 car length advantage over the 114 of Sean Connors with a two of Tony Martin in third, followed by Michael Prey and the 24 of Richard Kemp, who tried to make the charge at the 88 of Prey. That car, though, snapped a little loose off of turn number two. He washes up the racetrack. White flag in the air this time for your race leader. These heat races very quick here, being six laps for these mod lights as they zing around Arizona Speedway in this beautiful June night. So the checkered flag will fly. Brendan Priest, he'll take home heat race number two, followed by Sean Connors, Tony Martin, Michael Prey, and Richard Kemp. Two. 